One of the things I really love about uh, is we get into summer, potato salads. I love potato salads. I could eat them every day, you know, on picnics, lunches, dinner, breakfast, anything. Anyway, this potato salad is one I came up with a little bit different. It's anchovy caper olive potato salad. And mm, if you like anchovies, not, not everybody does, and I know that, but if you like anchovies, you're going to love this salad. Uh, just the, the flavor... It's just, I don't know, I guess it's kind of Mediterranean in a way, you know, with all the capers and the olives, and then the anchovies, and the anchovies actually do come from Italy. Mmm. Oh. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Mmm. All right. Let's go in the kitchen. Make some of this right now. All right, to make our potato salad, what I've got across the front here, first of all, is two tablespoons of Dijon mustard, one tablespoon of uh, small capers. You don't want the big capers. You can and just chop them up, but small capers are easier. Uh, one and a half teaspoons of dried thyme, one teaspoon of pepper, half a teaspoon of salt. Here what I've got is one of the small tins of anchovies. Now, the anchovies and the oil from the tin, and I've done is chop the anchovies up a bit. Now this is, uh, that's just this, you know, comes in a little box of this. Look at, I mean, isn't this cute? We got the cat and the bunny rabbit fishing for anchovies. It's gotta be good anchovies in here. All right, then what do we got? We've got uh, two tablespoons of sliced olives, one clove of garlic crushed, two tablespoons of vinegar, a quarter cup of uh, olive oil, and in here, what I've got now is two pounds or 900 grams of potatoes that have been just, I just roughly peel them. I, I, you know, little bits and pieces stay on there. I think that gives them character. And then they're cut to about a quarter inch thick or about five millimeters. Over here, I've got a pot of water just come to boil. So let's get the potatoes into there and get them boiling. Whoa, here comes the steam. All right, so what I'm gonna do now you can leave it uncovered or cover. I just cut down the amount of steam in the kitchen. Uh, I'm going to boil those potatoes for 10 to 15 minutes. What I want is that when I take a fork and push it into the potato, it goes in. You know, when right now they're hard, it's going to kind of stick on the surface, right? But once it goes in easily, but yet not too soft, I don't want it to overcook the potatoes. So just as soon as that fork can go in there, that's when they're done. So see you back here in about 10 to 15 minutes. All right, so the potatoes are cooked. You can see a fork goes in quite easily, just about too easily. Might have overcooked them by about a minute there. I'm not too sure. Still gonna be pretty good. These potatoes are a little bit of a mealy potato, so they, they quickly turn on you. <laughs> but still gonna be a really good potato salad. So what I'm gonna do now is we bring in a bowl and gonna make the dressing. So we wanna put in the uh, vinegar, the oil, and uh, salt and pepper, garlic. Let's see, make sure we get all that. All the garlic, uh, the uh, thyme, or thyme, I'm never too sure. Do you see that H in there or not? <laughs> and then in goes the uh, mustard. All uh, right, and what I want to do first now is whisk it. I'll bring that together. So whisk, 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 whisk until the oil is incorporated. Here, it's not separating anymore. That mustard always helps do that, bring it together. Now, I'm going to add in the anchovies and the anchovy oil and everything. And whisk that a bit more. Mmm. All right, toss in the uh, olives, toss in the capers, and the potatoes. And now all I'm gonna do, and since those are just a little bit getting soft on those potatoes, I'm gonna try to toss them gently. Gonna break some, that's okay. Just don't wanna mash them, right? 
Okay, so what you're gonna do now, just keep tossing until everything is coated with the dressing. Look at that, oh, the smell, the anchovies. I hope you like anchovies. <laughs> I love anchovies. Um, I'm one of those people who puts anchovies on pizza. I know, don't judge. Not everybody likes that, I know. My helper, I used to have a helper when I was in construction. Uh, in back in Canada and he would always like I would order pizza brought to the job site but then I'd have to go off somewhere get something something we needed some hardware we needed or some lumber or something and the sneaky little devil would steal my pizza you know one or two slices would be missing by the time I got back but he didn't like anchovies so he would pick the anchovies off well one day I ordered feta cheese Double anchovies. He gave up on that one. The uh, even the, the driver, the pizza delivery driver, said, "What kind of weird pizza is this?" Well, I loved it, and my helper no longer helped himself. All right, there we go. Look at that. That's going to be fantastic potato salad. It's going to let it sit cool down now. I'm going to take this after it cool. It's still a bit warm still. But once it's cooled a bit, cover it, toss it in the refrigerator, chill it down. Great salad, take it on a picnic, have it with a dinner tonight, is what we're gonna do. All right, look forward to that. All right, if you like this uh, anchovy caper olive potato salad recipe, stick around, there's a lot more original Kevin Riley Kuma's Kitchen recipes right here on YouTube. And make sure you subscribe because there's a new one coming up every Monday. Also, if you're not yet a patron of Kuma's Kitchen, well, consider becoming one because for as little as $3 a month, you'd be uh, supporting the creation of all these recipes, uh, putting them up here on YouTube, and you also get all the cool stuff that the patrons are getting right now in the Patreon feed. All right, now, go make this delicious salad and make cooking fun again with Kuma's Kitchen.